5 30 now his identity has been cleared but he's still locked out of his deo account yeah an unemployed senior citizen and his wife say even with identity verification his deo account keeps kicking them out causing another deo nightmare news six investigator mike holfeld is working the story everything was fine till the beginning of march william got locked out when it comes to identity verification, William and Karen Cooper have been caught in the DEO's version of Groundhog Day. William got unlocked two weeks ago. I was able to claim his four weeks for him, and all of a sudden, William was locked again. Confirming who he is with the IDME verification system hasn't been enough to access his own account again and again. Now, the one thing that gets me is, what's the reason for the lock? Is it ID theft or what? The simple answer is yes. As News 6 first reported, identity imposters have stolen millions in unemployment benefits as well as SBA loans. That's why the IDME checkpoint is in place. 10% of the folks that we verify will need to go through a video chat process. Former Army Intelligence Specialist Blake Hall is the CEO of IDME. He says the DEO updated the identity glitch on May 2nd. And we have seen a pretty dramatic decline in tickets that are coming in. But delays still exist. If you just verified, you need to wait, I think, I believe it's three days, so 72 hours for your account to get unlocked. But with Cooper's job still on hold, the financial pressure continues. Bill, how frustrating is this for you? <laughs> Quite. We brought their case to the DEO's reemployment team in Tallahassee. DEO Director Dane Eagle saying his staff is working to make sure these accounts are operating correctly. We're 100% committed to making sure people who are eligible receive uh, the payments that are owed to them. So we got to work those behind the scenes. And that continues to be a challenge when it comes to Connect. To handle that challenge, the DEO will be bringing in more than 400 people to handle cases just like that. If you have an unemployment issue, email us. Make ends meet at WKMG.com. Mike Hofeld, Getting Results, News 6.